Yes, Bam. here. It's very simple, it's very simple. But but, but say here, I've already checked. I've already checked. Yes. I've already checked. Cool. Yeah. I've already checked. <laughs> this is I've cool. Already, I've already checked. So what do you find most challenging? Mm, yeah, that's, uh, I'm not used. A problem. Yeah. I take the a noun as it is. If we, now I realize. Yes. It's not necessary to to say, to pronounce all yes. consonants. Exactly. So instead of saying out of, I link it, I connect and I say out of. Can you say out of? Out of. Hello everyone, welcome to English lesson of today. Of course, today I'm going to help you sound like English native speaker. How are you going to do that today? So today we're going to practice our English with a real conversation by English native speakers. So I have them here. We watch together, we listen together, we follow to see how they really connect to words, how they use reduction, how the accent works while they're speaking. So let's learn by listening and practice after them so that we can now improve our English pronunciation and sound like real native English speakers when we are speaking English. Let's now jump right in the lesson. So you are Ann Baxter. So you are Ann Baxter. So you are Ann Baxter. This is Ann Baxter. So you are Ann Baxter. So you are Ann Baxter. Does he say like that? No. Yes. Yes, I am. Yes. Yes, I am. Yes. Yes, I am. But really listen to how they pronounce, okay? Let's go a little bit back here. You are Ann Baxter. You are Ann Baxter. Yes. Yes, I am. I'm sorry. Really, I am so sorry. I'm sorry. Really, I am so sorry. I'm sorry. Really, I am so sorry. Can you repeat after them now? Nice to meet you. I'm sorry. Really, I am so sorry. I'm sorry. Really, I am so sorry. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. This is easy. You understand? I'm Mr. Steven. How do you do? I'm Mr. Steven. I am Mr. Steven. I'm Mr. Steven. Repeat after me. I'm Mr. Steven. I am Mr. Steven. But he says, I'm Mr. Steven. I'm Mr. Steven. How do you do? How do you do? I'm so sorry, Mr. Stevens. Anne, I'm sorry. Really, I am so sorry. I'm sorry. Really, I am so sorry. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. I'm Mr. Stevens. I'm Mr. Steven. How do you do? How do you do? I'm so sorry, Mr. Stevens. Anne. I'm so sorry, Mr. Steven. Hmm? Anne. Anne. This is Anne. Anne. Please sit down. Please sit down. Repeat after me. Anne, please sit down. Anne, please sit down. How do they pronounce? It's all right. How are you today? Anne, please sit down. It's all right. How are you today? Hmm? How are you today? I'm a little nervous. I'm a little nervous. I'm a little nervous. You know when you're nervous, okay? I'm a little nervous. I am a little nervous. I am a little nervous. But how they really pronounce this? Nervous. Hmm? I'm a little nervous. I'm a little nervous. I'm a little nervous. I'm a little nervous. Do you understand here? I am a little nervous. But the right pronunciation is this. I'm a little nervous. I'm a little nervous. 
and this isn't a good start. Uh, this isn't a good start. And this isn't a good start. And this isn't a good start. Repeat after me. And this isn't a good start. And this isn't a good start. And this is not a good start. But that's not English actually. So th did they pronounce? I'm a little nervous. And this isn't a good start. 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 Repeat after me. And this isn't a good start. And this isn't a good start. Thank you. Let's go on. That's all right. That's all right. That is all right. That's all right. That's all right. Well, Anne, where are you from? Well, Anne, where are you from? Well, Anne, where are you from? How do they sound? Well, Anne, where are you from? I'm English. I'm English. I'm English. I'm English. I'm oh. from Oxford. I'm from Oxford. I am from Oxford. I'm from Oxford. Great. 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 A true Brit. A true Brit. Can you speak any other languages? Can you speak any other languages? Can you speak any other languages? Repeat after me. Can you speak any other languages? Can you speak any other languages? French, German, Spanish. French, German, Spanish. Can you speak any other languages? Can you speak any other languages? Can you speak any other languages? I can speak French. I can speak French. I can speak French. I can speak French. Um, a little Spanish. Uh, a little Spanish. And a few words of Italian. And a few words of Italian. And a few words of Italian. I think it's easy to understand here. So you repeat after me. I can speak French. Repeat after me. I can speak French. A little Spanish. And a few words of Italian. My sister is in Rome studying. My sister is in Rome. In history of art. Good. My sister is in Rome. Let's go back a little bit here to see what she's saying here. Okay. We go back a little bit here. My sister is in Rome studying history of art. Mm? My sister is in Rome studying history of art. My sister is in Rome studying history of art. Do you understand this? My sister is in Rome studying history of art. My sister is in Rome studying history of art. Listen again. My sister is in Rome studying history of art. My sister is in Rome studying history of art. My sister is in Rome studying history of art. Connect words and... My sister is in Rome studying history of art. My sister is in Rome studying history of art. My sister is in Rome studying history of art. Okay. My sister is in Rome studying history of art. Yes, studying history of art. History of art. History of art. My sister is in Rome studying history of art. Now I see. Uh, I think now you see how they connect to it together. My sister is in Rome studying history of art. At okay. university. Okay. Okay. Very at university. Okay. Okay. Very interesting. Very interesting. Very interesting. Not very interesting. Very interesting. Very interesting. And can you use a computer? And can you use computer? And can you use computer? The internet. The internet. Repeat after me. And can you use computer? The internet. I'm not a genius with the computer. 
I'm not genius with a computer. But, but I can use one. Good. Let's go back here. I want you to listen. I want you to listen and understand here, okay? I'm not a genius with the computer, but but I can use one. I'm not a genius with the computer, but but I can use one. I'm not a genius with the computer, but but I can use one. I'm not a genius with the computer, but I'm not genius with the computer, but I can use one, okay? I'm not genius with I am not a genius with the computer, but I can use one. I am not a genius with the computer, but I can use one. So now listen to the pronunciation. I'm not a genius with the computer, but but I can use one. I'm not genius with the computer, but but can use one. I'm not genius with the computer, but I can use one. Repeat after me now. I'm not genius with a computer, but I can use one. Again, please. I'm not genius with a computer, but I can use one. I'm not genius with a computer, but I can use one. I'm not genius with a computer, but I can use one. Thank you. Great, Anne. Uh, I have your CV here. Great, Anne. I have your CV here. Great, Anne. I have your CV here. And I see you already work here. And I see you already work here. Uh huh. Eh? And I see you already work here. And I see you already work here. And I see you already work here. Repeat after me. And I see you already work here. And I see you already work here. And I see you already work here. What do you do exactly? 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 I do this and that. I do this and that. Okay, you understand? I do this and that. Um, I usually work from home. I usually work from home. From home. From home. I usually work from home. You see, they sound. I usually work from home. I usually work from home. I have an office in my room. I have an office in my room. Repeat after me. I have an office in my room. With a, a big desk and, and two chairs. And fine, fine. Okay, with a big desk and two chairs. With a big desk and two chairs. Fine, fine, fine. Okay, fine. That's, that's fine. That's, that's fine. Yeah. Uh, mm, that's fine, Anne. Uh, do you live alone? 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 No, I, I share a flat with... No, I, I, I share a flat. With my Australian friend Alice. With my friend Australian Alice. No, I share a flat with my Australian friend Alice. I share a flat with my Australian friend Alice. No, I share a flat with my Australian friend Alice. Okay? Good. Let's go. And there's a new flatmate now. Hmm? And there's a new flatmate now. Hmm? Let's go back here. I want you to understand so that you can repeat here. What you understand so that you can repeat. Repeat everything. Share a flat with my Australian friend Alice. And there's a new flatmate now. Mm -hmm. His name is Jack. He's from New York. Mm -hmm. And there's a new flatmate now. His name is Jack. He's from New York. And there's a new flatmate now. His name is Jack. He's from New York. And there's a new flatmate now. His name is Jack. He's from New York. Can you repeat there? And there's a new flatmate now. His name is Jack. He's from New York. And there's a new flatmate now. His name is Jack. He's from New York. 
and there's a new fat man now. His name is Jack. He's from New York. And there is a new flatmate now. His name is Jack. He is from New York. And there is a new flatmate now. His name is Jack. He is from New York. Good. How now do they pronounce him? And there's a new flatmate now. And there's a new flatmate now. His name is Jack. His name is Jack. He's from New York. He's from New York. Thank you. He's very nice. He's very nice. That's that's fine. That's that's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. That is fine. That's fine. Great and great and you're you're very well prepared. You're very well prepared. Great and you're very well prepared. Great Anne, you are very well prepared. So repeat like them. Great Anne, you are well prepared. You you have a good education. You you have a good education. You have a good education. Education. You have a good education. Repeat after me. You have a good education. And you're very precise. And you're very precise. And you are very precise. And you're very precise. You're just the person for this internship. You're just the person for this internship. You are just the person for this internship. Hmm? You are just the person for this internship. That's a phrase. You're just the person for this internship. You're just the person for this internship. Oh, thank you, Mr. Stevens. Oh, thank you, Mr. Stevens. Oh, thank you, Mr. Stevens. This is nice. Thank you so much for this opportunity. 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 Repeat after me. Thank you so much for this opportunity. Thank you so much for this opportunity. Good. Right this way. And right this way. And this is Gary. This is Gary. And this is Gary. And this is Rachel. And this is Rachel. And this is Rachel. Hello. Pleased to meet you. Hello. Pleased to meet you. Pleased to meet you. Hello. Pleased to meet you. Okay. Rachel is a very important team member at our eh? publishing house. Oh, let's go back here. I want you to understand here. What, what do they say here? Let's go back. A very important team member at our publishing house. She knows everything about the company. Okay. She knows everything about the company. Mm. Member at our publishing house. She knows oh. a very important team member at our pub. Rachel is a very important team member at our publishing house. Good. I want you to listen here. Listen, 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 and see how they connect to words, how they speak. Rachel is a very important team member at our publishing house. Rachel is a very important team member at our publishing house. Rachel is a very important team member at our publishing house. Can you repeat how this guy? Rachel is a very important team member at our publishing house. Rachel is a very important team member at our publishing house. Good. Rachel is a very important team member at our publishing house. Rachel is a very important team member at our publishing house. Rachel is a very important team member at our publishing house. Okay. Rachel is a very important team member at our publishing house. Good. Now the real conversation. Rachel is a very important team member at our publishing house. Good. Rachel is a very important team member at our publishing house. Rachel is a very important team. Rachel is a very important team member at our publishing house. Okay. Hmm. Lech is a very important team member of publishing house. Good. She knows everything about. 
Rachel is a very important team member at our publishing house. Rachel is a very important team member at our publishing house. Rachel is a very important team member at our publishing house. Mm -hmm. She knows everything. <sighs> she knows everything about the company. About the company. She knows everything about the company. She knows everything about the company. She knows everything about the company. She was our first employee. 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 1985. 1985. 1985. 1985. Okay. <laughs> and she can answer any questions you may have. Okay. And she can answer any question you may have. And she can answer any question you may have. And she can answer any questions you may have. And she can answer any question you may have. And she can answer any questions you may have. But you connect to it. And she can answer any questions you may have. And she can answer any question you may have. Okay, Anne, you're in good hands. Okay, Anne, you're in good hands. Okay, Anne, you are in good hands. Good? Now, the real pronunciation. Okay, Anne, you're in good hands. Okay, Anne, you're in good hands. Have a productive day. Have a productive day. Have a productive day. How do they pronounce? Have a, a productive day. Have a productive day. Okay, Anne, you're in good hands. Have a productive day. Do you understand now? Thank you so much. <laughs> oh, all right, Anne. All right, Anne. All right, Anne. All right, Anne. Are you ready? 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 Uh, well... Mr. Stevens founded this publishing house in 1985. Huh? Well, Mr. Stevens founded this publishing house in 1985. Well, Mr. Stevens founded this publishing house in 1985. Well, Mr. Stevens founded this publishing house in 1985. So, connect to words and they sound like English native speaker. Well, Stephen founded this publishing house in 1985. Oh, just a moment. Oh, just a moment. Oh, just a moment. Just a moment. Just a moment. <laughs> okay. 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 I'm ready now. I'm ready now. I am ready now. I'm ready now. Our first product was a children's book. Our first product was children's book. Our first product was a children's book. So, how do they link word and sound like native? Our first product was children's book. Our first product was children's book. Our first product was a children's book. Thank you. It was very successful and sold more than three million copies. Mm? Let's go back. We go back here. I want you understand here. Good. Mm. <laughs> okay. Okay. I'm ready now. Our first product was a children's book. It was very successful and sold more than three million copies. Mm -hmm. We had 20 different translations. It was very successful and sold more than 3 million copies. It was very successful and sold more than 3 million copies. It was very successful and sold more than 3 million copies. It was so. It was. It was very successful and sold more than 3 million copies. It was very successful and sold more than 3 million copies. It was very 
successful and sold more than 3 million copies. So, how to connect to words and the sound like a native? It was very successful and sold more than 3 million copies. It was very successful and sold more than 3 million copies. It was very successful and sold more than 3 million copies. Okay? We had 20 different translations. We had 20 different translations. We had 20 different translations. Over time, the over time, company changed and diversified. The company changed and diversified. Over time, the company changed and diversified and diversified. And we have now fiction. And we have now fiction. And we have now fiction. Cookbooks and tourist guides. Cookbooks and tourist guides. Cookbooks and tourist guides. Cookbooks and... I'm, I'm sorry. Cookbooks and... Sorry, I didn't catch that. I'm sorry, I didn't catch that. I, I am sorry, I didn't catch that. I, I'm sorry, I didn't catch that. Repeat after me this. I'm sorry, I didn't catch that. I didn't catch that. I didn't catch that. I didn't catch that. Well, thank you guys. I think now you see how you can practice with real English conversation and improve your English pronunciation to sound like native. So if you want really to sound like English native speakers, make sure you practice your English with English native speakers. Don't forget to subscribe so that you learn English with me every day for free. Bye-bye.